little uh, GWS Pico uh, stick. It's flying with a uh, a motor from uh, Heads Up RC. It's on a two cell. We've got an 800 milliamp battery on it. It's running a Castle Creations 9 amp speed control. We're using a GWS uh, four channel receiver. We're on channel 51. Tire Pro servos from uh, Heads Up RC. We're running a 9 947 uh, prop, GWS prop. Uh, the motor is the 2712-12, I believe. I think it's a 2712-12. And the plane's flying on about uh, right around 75 to 80 watts per pound. We've put aileron, ailerons on this little plane with double-sided servo tape, and then we added some El Elmer's glue around the edges. The plane weighs 8.6 ounces with an 800 milliamp 2 cell 20C LiPo battery. And we're going to give her a try. Will it fly? It flies. <laughs> yeah. Do our control service check. Here we go. Pretty much you have to. Uh, and no wind at all because she's pushing me around up there right now. I'm having a hard time getting it trimmed just because the wind's pushing me around. I can't tell which way the wind's going. My wind sock's hardly moving. I think one more approach with some throttle because uh, it's making a hard turn. I feel the wind in my back. Craig, explain to me the. Uh, is this this is supposed to to help keep the shaft from bending. Yeah, something? this is what you call a prop saver, and it's it's just the prop slides on the shaft, and it doesn't go on very far because you want the prop to have a little bit of play on the end and then you just put these rubber bands over the end of the prop and when you if you come down and you know like it's a little hard to land this morning because the winds pushed yeah, me around yeah. so if you don't get a nice landing which that wasn't really what we call a nice landing you, your prop hits the rubber bands give and you don't break I your see. prop or bend the shaft on your motor I see. I see. and uh,